Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to do a nude lip or a kind of lip combo that will make your lips look larger and fuller, a la Angelina Jolie lips. Um, I think my, my best feature is my lips because they're just very, not they're not large, they're not too big, they're not too small, they're just, I think they're a good size and shape. And so I definitely want to do things to kind of emphasize them. So I'm going to show you what I do. The first, I don't have anything on my lips right now, and the first thing I do is I use Cover FX, um, just this foundation or concealer to mute out lip, the lips. When you're when you're wearing um, nude lipsticks, you need to wear a concealer to mute out the lips, or else you're gonna get like not the full color it's supposed to be on the lipstick. Okay, so once that's muted, and you can also use it around your lips too like outside the lip line, you're going to need a good lip liner. I really like MAC Lip Liner and Spice because it's like the color of my lips, um, but a little bit darker. And the thing to remember about lining is just making sure you have a really defined cupid's bow and making the lines on the outside of the lips a little bit thicker. Okay, now you can see that I lined kind of towards the inside of the lips, and that's because you want to kind of have a darker shade on the inside and a lighter shade in the middle to make your lips look very, like, like very pouty. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take MAC Hue, and actually what I did with my lipstick is I actually wrote, like, the, I painted with nail polish just the color that the lipstick was because all my MAC lipsticks look the same, and I don't like to, like, find the sticker on the bottom all the time so when I reach them under my purse it's easy to see what lipstick I have so I just blot it on and I did this tutorial like four times but the lighting was bad in all of them so my lips are really like they hurt a little bit because I've been like <laughs> putting on so much lipstick on them and then I have a MAC lip brush and what you're gonna do So you're just going to blend the lip liner with the lipstick. Okay. And then the last step is to take a um, lip gloss. I'm using Stila Kitten, and this is a very popular lip gloss. It's like a, it reminds me of NARS Orgasm Blush. Okay. And then optional is, if you really want to go overboard with this, is to take a white eyeshadow. And this is Physicians Formula, just the, um, for brown eyes palette. And just take a white eyeshadow, like this, and dab in the center, and blot. And then also take a white eyeshadow and put it down your cupid's bow here to give you an extra highlight. So this is the final product. Do I look like Angelina Jolie? Hmm? <laughs> but this is really good because I think you can wear it with any kind of makeup look. Um, it doesn't look, you know, it's not too formal. You can wear it going shopping. You can wear it to work. It's just a really simple, nice nude lip. 
and it does make your lips look larger. Yeah? No? <laughs> okay, so again, the product I used was a concealer. Max Spice Lip Pencil, and this is um, 1450 and then MAC Hue, and I think Hue is probably one of the most popular MAC nudes. Also, um, Creme de Nude and Half and Half are also good colors by MAC. Um, another good color would be Belle de Jour by NARS. I th that's my favorite nude lipstick if I'm just going to wear it on its own because it's very, very, sh it's like very sheer almost, and it's not as pigmented, so it works a lot better with um, just wearing it alone without having to line or anything. And then Stila Lip Glaze in Kitten. So thanks guys for watching. I hope you have a great day.